The Oakland Raiders are next, 4-12 in 2018, to win the division, plus 1,800 odds out in Vegas. Shrink the schedule, number three most difficult. That's right. Turnover margin, 26th. They are minus seven. Or were minus seven. Over under is six and a half. To go over, the juice is plus 130. To go under, it is minus 140. Offense, total yards per play, they were number 21. They averaged 5.4 yards per play. Uh, on defense, number 32, dead last. Yep. Gave up 6.3 yards per play. Uh, defensive coordinator is Paul Gunther. Offense coordinator is Greg Olson. They signed wide receiver Antonio Brown, well, traded for. They signed right tackle Trent Brown. They signed wide receiver Tyrell Williams. They drafted Josh Jacobs out of Alabama. They drafted uh, Hunter Renfro, who, as crazy as this sounds, looks like he's going to start in the slot for him. Yep. I mean, it was a fifth-round pick and maybe starting. Uh, on defense, signed LaMarcus Joyner, safety. Signed Vontez Burvick, linebacker. Drafted defensive end Cleveland Farrell. And safety Jonathan Abraham. Or, sorry, Jonathan Abram. Ooh, Mississippi State fans will be mad about that. They are a projected favorite in only three games. I got him five and eleven. Got him four and twelve. And I think four and twelve might be more likely than my five and eleven. I don't know why. The, I, does hard knocks do you think influence the over under? Oh yeah, always, always. There's always a boost from hard knocks. Okay. There's always a boost because six and a half just seems absurd. Like I, I, John Gruden has a lifetime contract here. I mean, he's got the ten years, ten million dollars <laughs> there. There is a hundred million guaranteed. 100, yeah, that, yeah, all of it guaranteed. Like, like there's there's this year, nine years left on this Joker. Now, it, it, this is being released on Thursday, but can we talk for just a second about Antonio Brown? Okay. The the helmet situation. It's uh, just he don't want to play in training it, camp. We're just dragging this thing out. You think that's all this is? He's just trying to find he, an excuse he to has not said be there. He would not play football I, again if he can't wear his he's helmet. Got that he's got fifty million dollars coming to him. Did you see what happened? Like he he literally painted his old helmet. Like it took it to a shop, got somebody to do some crap paint job, and like he he wore his old Raiders helmet, and then he took his old like Steelers helmet and got it painted and wore it out there and the Raiders just you know, we can't let you on the field in that thing. We will get in trouble. We will get fined. We if something happens to you, we are in major trouble. We can't let you. And he said, screw it. And then went MIA. Like, they just they paid $50 million for this guy, and they can't even get him on the phone. And now they're going to an arbitrator, and they got it. which, why would the NFL, like, why even go to arbitration? Because like, they're trying to see if they can get money back. Oakland is? Yeah. No, if, but it was Antonio Brown that filed a grievance with the NFL. He's the well, that's one that's right. going But to they're the, going through an arbitrator to, to, to find some Happy medium between this, but if Antonio Brown stays his ground, they want that nineteen million dollar signing bonus back. Okay. So 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 it's easy for him to say, "I'm not going to play until I get a new helmet." The Oakland says, "This is not our decision. This is outside of our ability to make this call." If he walks away, we're guaranteed our nineteen back, right? I think that's I think that's why you got to. If you're Oakland, that's why you have to go to arbitration. Because you have to fight for what, what little you can get back. I don't see any reason why the NFL would agree to let him wear the old helmet. Well, no, they're not going to. There's like seven players that have to change helmets. Tom Brady's one of them. Like, there's a lot of guys that had old helmets that they they're all making them change this year. Yeah. So he's not the only one. He's just the only one. He's the only one that's a, complaining. That's being a baby. Yeah. I mean, it's it's. But he's nuts. a child. That's that's what children do. Ah, oh, goodness gracious! When the kid knocks the milk over, don't let the child handle the milk. You're right about that. 